Okay, we have another battle report going on today. Um, today we have a 1750 against, what are these, just Ultramarines? Ultramarines. Okay. This is Mike. This is uh, He Who Shall Not Be Named. <laughs> this is I Don't Know Who You Are, sorry. Wonderful. And this is my friend Chip, uh, who is anti-40K, but he's here to be a cheerleader. Moral Do a cheer. Support. <laughs> and of course, Brian is at the front. See, say hi, Brian. <laughs> Brian needs a haircut. Comment that he needs a haircut. <laughs> okay, so what do we got here? Show me what you got. Oh, we have some. Uh... Okay, so Mike broke the recording. We're gonna try this again, and hopefully. Okay, so let's start. Let's, I'll, I'll get down a better view this time. Okay, okay. go ahead. Um, HQ's librarian. Um, he's going to roll with a Stern Guard squad with some heavy flamers, all in a rhino. Um, the other elites are a couple of dreadnoughts, one with a last cannon, the other with twin auto cannons. We have an assault squad, two tactical squads that will also be in rhinos, um, two predators, and three land speeder typhoons. Okay. Some of this is painted, some of it isn't. It's better than my army. <laughs> um, so, then we got me over here. Um, which mine's a little spread out between this table and the other table where I'm starting to set up. Uh, I've got five knobs with the other five knobs that are sitting over there, and a ten-man squad, five power claws, five normal. Uh, I can't remember if I gave them armor or not. I probably did. Uh, I've got those two knobs go to the boy squads over here, uh, which I've got a unit of our boys, as, my, as I always do, and a unit of shooter boys with rocket launches. I've got four death coptas, a big mech with shock attack, a war boss who is geared to the T. Ah, my looted wagon, which is a second edition Gog Smasher with Tonka truck wheels on the sides. If you look very, very closely, you can see little orc skulls are in the hubcaps. Um, a lava, three cannons, a truck, and a death dread. This death dread is known as Old Stompy because he's old. I think he's like a second or second edition uh, death dread. But yeah. We're getting ready to roll for first turn. Uh, we'll roll for setup. Roll in general. So, okay. So we rolled a two uh, for seize ground, which that's the one where uh, is it the base? Two objective or plus D three. Two Lots objective plus D three. Okay. This is the board that we're going to be playing on. It's kind of sparse. We're, we don't have a lot of terrain at the moment at the store. We're going to be working on that as well. Um, so let's see uh, what kind of deployment we get. Deployment. Spearhead. Three. Spearhead. Oh, okay. So that's the one that's just Table split quarters. down the middle. Oh. Table. table quarters. Oh, this is going to be interesting. <laughs> I haven't played a table quarters game in a while. This is going to be interesting. Okay. Now, um, let's go ahead and see who gets first turn. Just let me get a dice out here. Uh, okay. Sorry, I keep putting my finger in front of the video camera. Ah, I get first turn. Start. All right. Okay, so um, I got first turn. So uh, I set up over in this corner. Uh, we forgot to put our objectives down, so we had our friend Chip do it. You've got an objective there. There's one there behind the column. There's one over there, the little skull pile in between all those boys. There's one right there. There's one right there. Unfortunately, I've already got like two of them and then two more of them really close by. And he's only got the one right over here. And here's how he's set up over in this corner. So I'm getting ready to go, and uh, this is going to be interesting. I'd say it could go either way, really, depending on how good his shooting is and how fast my guys are. Okay, so this is the, uh, the end of my first turn. I moved my guys up. Uh, I fired at some stuff. Uh, I didn't really affect much of anything on this side. Uh, that Predator and Assault Marines got shot at, nothing happened. Um, but I did kill a Land Speeder, and I killed a Predator with the uh, Rocket Launcher Boys, which was very nice. So uh, he's getting ready to go, uh, and we're going to see how this goes. Okay, so here's the, uh, the top of two. Um, what, you fired on a couple things. You killed some uh, Ard Boys, and you blew up my truck. Killed the can. He killed the can. The, uh, the can is gone. Um, nothing else is really going. I'm about to uh, roll and see if I get my uh, reserves in. Five plus for reserves, I believe. And I do. Uh, because of the fact that they have scout, they have uh, outflank, I believe. And so we have to roll for that. They can either come in on left or right side, I believe. So we're about to see what happens with that. Okay, so... Um, 
I just got done with my second turn. The death coptas came in and they fired at the uh, at the dreadnought and did jack crap. I came in over here. Uh, the knobs kind of moved up. Nothing else really special. They moved up. Uh, shock attack guns splooged again. Uh, didn't do anything. The uh, death guns uh, took out another predator. Um, yeah, the predator over there is gone now. Uh, the boom gun. Uh, did the boom gun kill something? No, no, it didn't. Well, it destroyed a um, I tore up the the predator, or not the predator, the dreadnought over there, and the land speeder, and did all sorts of damage there, immobilized and weapons destroyed, and all sorts of stuff over there. Um, and he kind of shot up a little bit. Well, he didn't shoot. He, it's, he's on his turn right now. But that's generally what happened there. And he's moving all of his stuff right now. He's going to take the charge away from me, it seems, with the assault marines over here. Okay, so uh, this this turn in the space marines player. Uh, that's his favorite bit. I've got to make a regroup roll. Actually, I'm going to do that at the beginning of my turn right now. See if these guys regroup before they go off the board because they failed their leadership. Ah, <laughs> uh, they don't. They don't. Unless I get three one. Hell, even if I do get three ones, they're gone. You came very close to getting three ones. I bet they go four inches, so the deaf copters have left the building. Crap. Da -da -da. <laughs> so there's a squad completely useless now. Useless death copters. Bad death copters. Bad. Um, okay, so he ate the knobs for breakfast. The war boss is sitting on one wound left. It's probably going to get eaten by that power, power fist wielding assault marine. Okay, so um, shooting did not go so well for me this time. I managed to take out the dread, and I managed to shake the land speeder that's already immobilized, and I somehow managed to not die with the war boss, but other than that, uh, nothing really momentous happened. He's getting ready to go, and we're just going to call it after this because it's getting late. Okay, he's running away because they uh, they shooed him away really horribly. He failed uh, failed his morale check when they lost the combat. I only lost my one. Um, nothing else really happened other than them just blowing him blowing the hell out of both of those uh, boys and knobs. So I'm getting ready to go.